what's up guys it's me again um today we are going to be installing some shocks on the obs chevy because they've been really really bad and i'll see what else i do to it just because i don't just want to make a video on shocks you know so i'm gonna do the rear and the front shocks I got all four just because I was like, if I'm replacing the rears, might as well do the fucking, you know, the fronts. Alright, so I found out what else I'm going to be doing in this video. I'm going to be installing brand new taillights on the truck. Fuck it. I don't have them on me. I'm going to order them right now. But, yeah. I really wanted red taillights from the jump, you know. But, my dad didn't want red. He wanted black or some shit. But since now the truck is mine, I could do whatever I want to it, right? So these are the tail lights right here. I'm gonna show you guys. I hope it's not too loud. We got a compressor running. But these are the tail lights. I don't really fuck with them, you know. Hey, they grow on me, but I still prefer red over clear. And they were supposed to be black. They weren't even supposed to be clear. I don't know what the fuck I did wrong, but today in this video, I will be buying new ones. So I'm gonna order them real quick and just wait till they get here and install them. So for the shocks, those are the shocks right there. All right, before I swap them out, I'm gonna just show you guys how bad they are. Look, so. I'm really skinny as you can see just I got some chopstick legs um, but look it's not supposed to be doing that so I'm gonna go ahead and replace all four of them these are the new ones right here that's the rear and then the fronts are over here one of these so I'm gonna go ahead and get into the car I'm not even gonna jack it up I'm just going there and install these. I don't know if I'm gonna need to jack up the front, but for these, I could just go under the truck, take the nut off, and then, you know, do the, all that shit, you know? So, as you can see how fucked up they are, these are the shocks. So, bruh, what the fuck? This is, so. 20, 21, I just, I gotta get a long socket. So, I'm gonna get a long socket and then loosen this shit up. Just look at how bad these are. The bushing's not even in the damn shock. So, I can't wait to see how this thing drives after. Before I try to loosen this shit up, I'm gonna put double D40. So, I used the impact drill or impact gun. So, what I did was, I, this bowl is a 21 millimeter, and then this is an 18 millimeter. You could put there so it doesn't spin. And after you do that, it's off. Now, for those shits, um, up here, those are, what, 10 millimeter probably? I think so. Thirteen millimeter with extension. All right, one is out. Just to look how fucked up these are. That's not even supposed to come out. It's supposed to be in like that. So also, if you're doing this job yourself, the very top ones right there, they have these bolts. And you would try to take this nut off, but you might run into the issue where the whole bolt starts to fucking spin like me. And I was like, why the fuck, how the fuck am I gonna take it out? So you have to grab a 12 millimeter 
and hold it from the very top over here and then take it out. All right, so I got in the new shock, but when you're doing this, put some on protection. We're all done with one, you know. It's time for the other one over there. If you're wondering how your shocks are bad, just press them in. This should be going out. So I am all done with the with the back. I'm gonna now start up with the front. So here's the last one. Crashed. That little piece is supposed to go in there. So let me just start on the front real quick. I'm gonna pop the hood and see what the fuck I'm gonna have to do because this is my first time doing the front. So I've done the rear on a dually Silverado. So I guess this is my first time doing it on a single wheel. So yeah, let's get started. So under the hood, the shock is right there. I'm gonna have to take the wheel off and yeah. The fronts are as fucked as the rear. Good thing I got them new. <laughs> so, let's go ahead, put some WD-40 on those rusty ass bolts and take them out. These are also 13 millimeter bolts, so I'm gonna hand loosen them and use the power to go faster. What up guys? Um, I just finished putting in the shocks and holy cow, it's a fucking night and day difference. I didn't realize how much it would like change like the drive, I guess, but fuck, this feels, this feels really, really fucking good. Holy shit. I was doing the front shocks, but then my dad came in and helped, but you know, when he helps, he always just takes over, so. I did the rear myself. Um, the front I did one, which is the pass the driver side. Then he came and did the passenger. I did help a bit, but hey, you know he did most of the work. So yeah, we're done with the shocks. Now I'm just gonna order some new tail lights, and when they come by, I'll install them. So I'll see y'all in a bit. Peace. Seats. Super sick. Damn, these look hella fucking nice, bro. No way, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna start to take out the tail lights. So it's only two bolts again. This one, this one, and then you just pull it off. Take it off. This is one. These are way, way cleaner, bro. Just look at this. It came with this wire, but all I needed to do was just connect it from there and then just connect these wires to the truck's wires, which made it so easy. And it's not such a mess like this. Like all that weird shit. So, really, really good. I'm gonna go ahead and put them on now. All right, y'all tell me which one looks better. For some reason, there's a fucking big ass gap now. I don't know if that's a trunk aligned or that's a headlight. I mean, the tail light. Shit, I just noticed that right now. Let's look. La <laughs> roja. No sé si es la caja o no sé, pero si sí se ve el gap. Va a ser la luz. ¿La luz? Sí, porque si miras esta, y esta, esta, no, es, esta no está pareja, esta está metida para allá. All right, all done, guys. I just don't know why there's a big ass gap. I don't know if it had a big ass gap with the original, like the, you know, the truck's original taillights, but it's got gaps on both sides now. This one's really flush. You see that? Yeah. 
over here. It's not so flush, it's like tighter here at the bottom and then it just loosens up. I don't know, I had to do some cutting on the plastic on the other one over there. But this is what the truck is gonna be looking like. You know, the black ones, they grew on me and shit. They really did. But I don't know, just something about the red that I like. Now looking at it with the red lights, it looks a bit weird, obviously, cause you know, I just put them on and I was used to the black ones or the clear tail lights, but it'll, it'll, you know, it'll settle. It'll um look better after a while. Like from here, I don't know if you guys can see the reflection, but she looks nice. I really don't like the space though, the gap. I don't know how to take that off. I don't know if that's the truck or that's the taillights or I don't know. But yeah, this is it. I'm gonna turn the hazard lights on and the reverse just to see if I Hooked it, up, hooked it up correctly. All right, yeah, they work. You guys see the reflection? You guys saw it a little bit. I got the LEDs, LED everything, but way better. So guys, that's the end of the video. I'm sorry I look fucking like black and white and shit. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I don't have a fucking, what do you call it, outro or the ending. You know, the end of the video, I don't have one. But hope you guys enjoyed the video. What do you guys think about the taillights? Um, I, I really fuck with the red, not gonna lie. I really fuck with red. Um, the clear taillights look cool and all. They look, I don't know if I want to say aggressive. I don't know. But something about them was like, it was nice, you know? Nice to have on the on the truck. But I just always like red taillights on black cars. And... I don't know, especially on that truck. It looks really fucking good. But, yeah, that's the end of the video, guys. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it one more time. Um, like, comment, subscribe. I got more shit coming. I'm actually... I don't know what I'm going to do next to the truck, like, for a video. But I got some crazy shit interior-wise for it. Not really crazy. It's basic, but... For me, it's fucking crazy because it's the shit I'm going to do. That's the biggest thing I'm going to do to the truck, I think. So just stay tuned, I guess. What the fuck? Oh. All right, guys. I'll let y'all go. I'm talking too much. Like, comment, subscribe once again. Peace.